Going to the Texas Tech Red Raiders. Matt Wells going into his third season there. And the Red Raiders have not uh, finished above 500 since 2015. It's kind of insane to think about, really. Uh, what Mike Leach had built there stands no more. 4-8 and eight in 2019, 4-6 last year. FPI projects them to go 7-5 and five this year. SP Plus projects them to go 5-7. and seven. And the win total sits at 4.5. So FPI, way off, way off with this. So, uh, but you know that's sometimes the way uh, these analytics go. That's the way they go. Um, you can kind of always count on Texas Tech to have a good passing game, but 2020 it was not. Uh, so, with that said, Matt Wells brought in offense coordinator Sonny Cumbie from TCU and brought in transfer quarterback Tyler Shuck, and Alan Bowman is out of here. Adios, muchachos. Uh, Red Raiders have, um, you know, the defense. Like, biggest weakness was a weak pass rush. Everything else was okay. Like, not great, but okay. Um, No real strengths. Only one real weakness. But they hadn't been great. So they brought in a ton of P5 uh, defensive transfers to kind of help fix issues. I don't know what any of that means. Like, is Tyler Shuck going to be okay? Like, I'm going under. Like, it's plus 125. To go under the four and a half, it is minus one fifty five to go over. And and I look at the schedule, and yes, it's like Stephen F. Austin, Florida International, Kansas, uh, in Kansas. But Congratulations! Can, can I get them to five? I don't think no, so. No, I, like, I can't. I can't get them there. I think. I think three is the number. Could they win four? Sure. Are they beating two people they're not supposed to beat? Nope. I don't think so. Nope, I just don't. I, I'm not believer in this Texas Tech team. I'm just not. I just, yeah, I'm with you. Uh, Matt Wells, like if if he finishes below 500 again, is that it for him? I don't know. I don't know what the standards are at Texas Tech, so I don't. I don't know the answer. I think that. they might give him one more year after that. But man, like, I mean, you go something disastrous like two and ten. Yeah, you're probably out of there. But you know, you go four and eight. Okay, we'll try. We'll try one more time. You know, everybody's kind of still hurting from from all the the COVID stuff, but I don't know, it's man. Rough. That's rough. Rough. Finally, thanks for listening to the Winning Cures Everything podcast. The website is winningcureseverything.com, and if you want to connect with us, we're on Twitter at Gary WCE, at Chris B Giannini, at Winning Cures, or you can email us Gary at winningcureseverything.com or Chris at winningcureseverything.com. Subscribe everywhere you need to subscribe, and we'll see you soon.